Tony is also a person of individual taste, having designed his new van to suit his lifestyle because taking an extra passenger or two is always a possibility. It's predominantly two people, but everyone's got someone else, you know. Yeah. I, I was having a look at the van I've got here. and This is a, the Majestic. The Majestic here. It's a beautiful, beautiful it's, van. It's an option to convert it to, say, take the grandkids. We fitted a dinette in it that's a little bit longer than normal. Yep. That would actually drop into a bed for, for grandkids. Is it better than your first flat? Unbelievable. <laughs> You put the flat in the ensuite. <laughs> you would do. Yeah. But you can pretty much put anything into a van now. We can put a, a mini grill or a full oven. We can put a large fridge. I've got a fridge freezer in the van I've got with me today. Right. Um, which is what you've got at home. You bet. So, Tone, if you're going off the beaten track or going to be staying out at parks for a little while, what sort of options would you be looking at? Well, as it comes, the Majestic comes standard with a battery and a charger. Your gas is an independent source of power to, to say, your stove, your fridge, your hot water service can be run off the gas. Your 12 volt covers your lighting. You can adapt a charger from your car to the battery. Yep. And keep the battery topped up. And when it came to designing his van, Tony's pretty sure who had the final say. I'd like to say it's a combined decision, but I'd... I think I know which way you're angling at, mate. Yeah, I think the lady has a big say. I think they do, don't they? Oh, of course, yeah. And I can see it now. With the space they've got to live in for a longer period of time, a female tends to know they want some more pot drawers, they want some extra storage space. Everything's refining. And lastly, where would you advise people to go? Mate, you've got a pretty big country here. You can go wherever you like. 